The first time that I met Sophie, she pretty much just swooped me up with her charisma. The first time you meet her, you're just like... Mm -hmm. It is a little bit like that. We were like, wait, She's... what? <laughs> one, two, one, two, three. My name is Mary Kermo, and I work with Greg Curtis of Extraordinary Record. Mary! Hi, so. I couldn't help but think that it must have been a lot like what it would be like to meet Shirley Temple when she was little. She really draws people in, and she's a singer, which uh, she told me right away. <laughs> You're acting kind of smart until your heart just goes wop. It's been quite a whirlwind. I can remember seeing Sophie on America's Got Talent. I was watching the show with my wife and this little five-year-old girl trots out on stage. When she started singing, I was amazed. You know we do is fight and just a dot on the map. You're hooked, you're cooked, you're caught in the tender trap. Everybody that meets her is blown away. How could you not be? Hi, Sophie. Hi. It's nice to meet you. Sophie, so you like Frank Sinatra. How old are you now? Five. You're five. And how old were you when you started singing Frank Sinatra? Um, when I was four. Okay. So a year ago you started. Uh-huh. Sophie, should we go to your favorite judge first? Well, we weren't expecting that, Sophie. Sophie, you know what? I love that song. And normally people about 90 sing that song about what their life's been about, and you sing it at five. You are hilarious. I want you to date my son. <laughs> I'm Gary Lux. I am the recording engineer on this project for Sophie. I am recording the uh, band and the big band and the orchestra. We start recording the band and the big sound. Of, I've recorded Frank Sinatra in my in my young days, so I, I remember the big band sound. I was really in shock when we started playing and then Sophie started singing and I I just <laughs> I nearly fainted. Can you make this? Yes, I can. That's what I was about to do because I want you to be comfortable. And I don't think I really need this. So much. Sophie is such a unique talent and such a unique personality for somebody her age. When you see her sing and you see her perform, it's almost like she's having an out of body experience, you know, because you look at her, she comes off and has the persona of somebody much older than she actually is. You hear her speak and you see the way she can command the room and command an audience and command a song for that matter.
a big voice uh, for such a young person. She's got a great instrument, so I think we're going to hear great things from her. I don't think I've ever met a little girl that can sing like that at that age with time and everything. It's pretty amazing. She holds you tight and you hate yourself for me. From hearing her voice, such a big voice, and you can tell inside her little body is a, you know, a real old soul. Has to be to be able to, you know, put out the music like that. That feeling for the American Songbook and for that period of time where the music was so wonderful. It's great to see that in somebody so young. Really refreshing. It's really an interesting thing because somebody her age should not be able to do that. She has a maturity. I mean, she's kind of an old soul in that respect, especially, you know, singing Sinatra songs and singing big band jazz. You know, that's not something you would expect a little girl her age to do, but yet she does it not in a, a tentative way, but in a commanding way. We just got through recording six tunes. Great band, and Sophie is fantastic. We had a lot of fun.